Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Edmund Mindaros, and for today's quick tutorial, and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve if you're coming across an issue when running Diagnostic Utility under Windows 11 or Windows 10 computer when it says that there are settings that might be blocking the connections. Alright, so without further ado, and let's go ahead. Ang next step ay dito na sa searching bar ng ating computer. I type mo nang dito yung uh, control panel. And then click mo lang itong open. And the next step ay dito lang sa category. Click mo lang itong arrow na to. And then silik mo lang dito yung large icon para makita mo lahat ng settings. And the next step ay kina mo lang silik dito yung Windows Defender Firewall. So dito sa Windows Defender Firewall ay kina mo lang silik dito yung Restore Defaults. Okay, so click mo lang ito. And then makikita mo dito yung Restore Default Settings. And the next, kina mo lang i-click itong Restore Defaults. And then pop up ito, restore the force confirmations, restoring the default settings will delete all settings of Windows Defender Firewall that you have made since Windows was installed. This may cause some apps to stop working. So do you want to continue? And then click mo tong yes. And then next, I close lang natin dito. And then next method na pwede natin gawin, ay dito lang sa search yung barati computer. I type mo lang dito yung CMD or ito yung tinatawag na command prompt. And then, kailangan mo lang mag-right click dito. And then, select mo lang dito yung run as administrator. So, dito sa administrator command prompt, ay kailangan mo lang i-type yung command keyword na ipconfig space slash flash dns. Okay? So, one word yung slash flash dns. And then, press mo lang yung enter. At makikita mo dito yung na successfully flash the DNS resolver caching. And the next command keyword na pwede natin enter dito, ay kaya mo lang i-enter tong command keyword na NETSH o NES space when sa space reset. Right? So kaya mo lang i-enter yung command keyword na NETSH space when sa space reset and then press mo lang enter. At makikita mo dito na successfully reset the WinSock catalog, you must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Alright, so close lang natin dito sa CMD and then kailangan mo lang mag-restart. Okay, click mo lang ito. Alright, so ganoon lang po kasimple kung paano natin i-fix ang security or firewall settings might be blocking the connections in Windows 11 or Windows 10. Okay, so please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial.